Now, since we have the data on our backend, that means on our register, and in this form we are validating, when validation passes, we create a new user. And we can simply say user colon colon create and then I can say this arrow form which is including everything like email password password confirmation and uh, email password everything is there okay so we have done that and what we need to do next after creating the user we need to simply say redirect to slash login page and why not give a name to this login so I can say name is login and you can see we can simply do everything we have on Laravel we can do the same on Laravel liveware routes so we can give the name also so instead of this I can use route of name okay so we are creating the user and then we redirecting the user to the login page okay so let's see whether this is going to work or not and remember in our user model we are just having fillable th things like name email and password but we are giving the plain password so we need to firstly decrypt it or we need to make it hashed so we can create simply and simply a mutator uh, mutator and mutator name is set password attribute and we get the value value and then we can say this attributes name is password and that is bcrypt of value so now when we are creating the user we are also bcrypting the password and then storing into the database and yeah we can redirect and let me take you to the live wire documentation and here we can see we have the redirection we can easily use the redirection like this or like this whatever you want but because everything is good we also have a login page which is not having the form but we will create that and let's work on this and like here and that should be bit fumes then secret one two three then comes secret one two three and now hit register and it says live by user so we need to grab the user use it at the top that's good close it once again click on register and now instantly I am redirected to login page and you have seen that there was no refresh because we have used the turbo link and the turbo link live wire create the single page application it's redirected and in our database if I open the database of let's use live wire user and we have a new user called sarthak at bitfilms.com and password is hashed that's very very nice and that's cool and next is we need to create the login of the user so let's copy everything from this blade file of register and close 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 and I will open login dot blade and I will paste everything and I call this as login here login time and uh, this is good <laughs> then we just need we don't need actually name so name is not required so delete that field we need we need the email the password and the confirmation password so now we have these two things and that submit button should be login and that's cool let's go here reload the page and login time is there and yeah similar to register we need to create a form that hold the email and the password okay so go to the login live wire component and because you know things I will going to create a form and inside the form we can say oops oops email is empty then we we need to say password is empty and close this 
so we have these things and now we already have the wire model because we have copied from the register wire model we have wire model we have for the password and that's good and we just need one more thing which is the submit function inside the login component to handle the submission so let's create that also and then we are ready to go let's now really log in the user